Hi, <clears throat> now I'm going to show you the steps to change the flow sensor. So when something goes wrong with the flow sensor, so how you would find it out is that, first of all, there will be an indication or there will be a message here at the bottom saying that the flow sensor is not working. You need to either recalibrate the flow sensor or change the flow sensor. And when you, once you see that, you have to come, you need to just take off all these parts that are attached to the that are attached to the flow sensors and you need to just pull this out like this and you see this part here this one has to be unplugged so well, how you do it is yes there is a there is an indication or there is um, these these words that says press so you need to press at those point and just pull it down. And once you pull it down, the flow sensors come, it, it gets disconnected from this cable, flow sensor cable. And then you disconnect this part of the flow sensor and this whole thing can gets replaced. So I'll just show you that now. So you need to just uh, take it off like this. You can leave it here and you just have to press press I just uh, so you need to just press this and just pull it down it comes back and when you put it also you have to be careful because there are um, grooves that go into the these uh, um, these thing I'll just show you <clears throat> if I can So there is this grooves. So and the, the flow sensor also has a groove. You see that? So it has to go into the right ports. So you have to make sure that happens. So this whole thing comes apart. You take take the brand new one and you put it back here, like put it back into this, and then put it connect back. It's it's that simple. Hope this helps. Thank you.